Good evening and welcome to tonight's edition of Pillow Talk, where tonight we'll be interviewing Yasmin Puya, our guest star. Tonight is all about dreams. Welcome, Yasmin. Hi. So why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? Where are you from? I'm from San Antonio, Texas. And Have you grown up there? Yes. Since I was born. I've never gone anywhere else. And have if you could live anywhere in the world, where would it be? I have been, I went to Europe like two years ago and I would love to live there, but not permanently. Like I think I'm going to stay in Texas probably when I'm older, but I would love to like live abroad for like a few years. And are you planning on studying abroad through Baylor? Yes. Well, that's exciting. No. How many schools did you apply for in high school? I think like five or six. I applied to UTSA because my mom didn't want me to leave San Antonio. I applied to Texas State because it was like an hour away. I applied to Baylor, obviously, but funny story about that. And then I applied to UNT and somewhere else, but I forgot. Well, let's jump into this funny story about why you chose Baylor. Okay. So I was done applying and last minute I like just ran across Baylor and I was like oh it's private school I went to private school my whole life so I like clicked on it and I was only gonna do it if it was like easy to apply to and there was no essay so I just did it yeah I just did it really 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 quick and I got in and then it ended up being the only school I like visited Mm -hmm. so are you happy with your choice I'm so happy I love it and uh, did any of your family members go to Baylor before you? No, they went to UT. Okay, both your mom but, and dad. Mm-hmm, but that wasn't my thing. It's too big. Yeah, I love like the small atmosphere. Yeah, I know. I visited there a couple times, and it's too very, big. very intimidating. So, where did your parents? You said your parents graduated from UT, yes. and is that where they met? Yes, in Austin. Well, that's exciting. Mm-hmm. And do you have any brothers and sisters? I'm an only child. Oh, wow. I know. So, was it different, like, growing up as an only child? Not really. I, like, have a big family because of all my cousins, and they're, like, my brothers and sisters. So, were they over a lot? All the time. Yeah. Like, every day. So, I didn't feel like I missed out on anything. So, are your parents pretty strict when it comes to rules? Not really. I I was, like, a really, really good kid, so I was trusted. That's good. (laughs) Did you ever have a curfew growing up in high school? Not really. I'm just like, Mom, I'll be home at yeah. like a certain time. And she's like, okay, just tell me where you are. Yeah. So, that's fine. Well, it must be nice. It was. So, what do you enjoy to do? What are some of your favorite things? I just like hanging out with my friends. Mm-hmm. I love movies. I like just sitting around and doing nothing. What are and some of your favorite movies? I don't know. I really, really, really like Taken. Yeah. I like, like, not like scary, but like action. Yeah. Action-packed thrillers. Oh, yeah. So, do you play any sports? I used to play tennis, like, earlier in high school, but Mm -hmm. I'm, like, flat-footed, so I would always roll my ankle. Oh, oh my gosh. I know. I wore, like, an air cast all the time. Oh, well, that is not fun. But I haven't played lately. So, what about intramurals? Because I know you're a Kappa at Bailey. Yes, I am. So, do you enjoy playing intramurals? Um, I signed up for bowling, but they canceled it. But I did table tennis. Well, that's nice. Yeah. I mean... Gotta stick with something. Yeah. And do you plan to be involved in any clubs or anything in the future? I was looking into, I forgot what it was called. It was like Baylor Buddies or something. Okay. When you go and hang out with like the younger kids. Oh yeah, I have mm-hmm. heard about that. Because I went to line camp before I came to Baylor and we like did that for like two days or something and I really liked it, but I just didn't have time last yeah. year. But yeah. I'm like finding my way, like time management. Well, hopefully you will get to be able to do that. So does that tie into your major at all? I am a public relations major. I switched it back and forth from business and public relations, but right now I'm minoring in business. Okay. So I'm keeping public relations. But so far, so far I like it. Well, that's good. Mm-hmm. I haven't really gotten into, like, the actual, like, core, 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 core classes. classes but yeah. It's fun so far. So, um, do you see, where do you see your major taking you in the future? I really would like to be, like, a representative or, like, Neiman Marcus or Nordstrom's or something. Or one of my really good friends, um, aunts, was a public relations major, and she works for a hospital, for a children's hospital. Oh, wow. And she, like, manages, like, all of, like, their guests that they have go in and stuff. And that would be, like, really, really fun, I think. Talk about dream jobs. Mm-hmm. That's awesome. Well, since we're all about dreams tonight, what would your dream man be like? Tall, dark, and handsome. <laughs> of course. With a great personality and... Well, a 
that's all that matters. And that's all the time we have for tonight. Thank you so much.